WTAJ Sports with Jack Washer. In late January, Penn State basketball fell to 0-10 in conference play, and the season looked lost. Pat Chambers job security felt uneasy from the outside, but as coach said, time after time after time, we're close and it's showing. And Penn State looking for their seventh conference win of the year, taking on Illinois and welcoming back a program great Shep Garner and his mom, Lisa, who sang the national anthem beautifully. It was also senior day and this senior Josh Rees, he went out firing in a sea of glory. 11 first half points for the Virginia native. Three pointing not his best when he came here, but no denying him yesterday. Later on, Jamari Wheeler driving, dishing, finding Rajir Bolton. Bolton high arching three buckets as Penn State gets to within three. Then check this out. Off the steal, it's Wheeler finding Lamar Stevens. And Stevens putting his guy on a poster. Da -na -na, da -na -na. Penn State would trail by one at the half. But Rees would pick off where he left off in the first half. A career high 26 points on senior night to go along with 14 boards as Penn State took the lead for good. And then we're just having fun. Wheeler with the lob to Stevens, throwing it down. Then Wheeler on the break, finding Reeves. Wheeler with a career high nine assists. Penn State, 72 56, the final. They get a buy in the Big Ten tournament. Pat Chambers, talk to me. I said that to you all year long. I said the record is not an indication or a reflection of how hard we were playing, how hard we were competing. We were so close in so many games, it easily could have been flipped 13 and 7 instead of 7 and 13. Um, uh, again, the credit goes to the players and the staff. They did such an amazing job of, of showing up every single day and getting better. That was our two things, improvement and identity. Let's just improve a little bit each day, and let's just focus on our identity, which is defending and rebounding. 